Okay, welcome to Northern Ants. This is Mark, and I am out trout fishing. I, I'm not going to keep any of the fish, but I got, I've come to this location uh, a couple weeks ago, and I did really, really good. That's like I was catching fish after fish after fish, and it figures I didn't bring my did not bring my pole or my camera with. No, I brought the pole. I caught a lot of fish. Uh, um, <laughs> no, I didn't. I didn't bring the camera with. So we're going to be hitting that same spot that I had hit a couple weeks ago and caught all the fish. So I'm going to bring you along this time and I, hopefully the fish are biting as good as they were the other day and hope you enjoy the video. Let me know in the comments. I will talk to you soon. Before I get in the water, I haven't really done much in the way of fishing videos this year. I just haven't been in the mood to fish. It's funny, some years I'm like, want to be out on the lake all the time, want to, you know, like, there was times when I would fish every single night I haven't been in my boat in, in months actually try to, get this. try to get the crawler on there I always use like the head first it seems like they don't strip that off as quickly as some other parts of the night crawler so we'll put that on here. Yeah. Hopefully I've got a good camera here. We will see. Okay, let's go get in the water. This will only be the second time I've ever fished this location. It looks like other people do fish here. Because uh, is pretty deep down. So people must fish here quite often. See how the water level is. It's pretty low last time I was here. It hasn't rained, so it shouldn't be bad. The thing I like about this is it's almost like watch, walking on a beach. There's a culvert there. farther downstream there's a more sand. So here's the area here. I'm gonna try I think this spot right here is I cut some fish out of this last time. This is one of the spots I cut quite a few of them. Actually this little Corner rapids here. Ooh, oh, and they stripped my worm before I even got a chance. That figure. Here. And there's this is one of the spots I caught. Probably caught uh, six or seven of them here. There we are. We got a little trout. Little guy. Boy, the last time there was no small ones like this. They were all pretty nice size. better one. Hoping my camera's at a good angle where I'm not blocking it.
I was looking at these, like, pole holsters. I should have got myself one. Where you can set your pole and holster on your hip while you're tying the, tying the line. I'm tying the hook on. Putting the bait on and tying hooks and stuff. Yeah, there's a bunch of them right there. You know, it's always cool to see what the camera actually picks up. There we go. That's a little nicer one. That was pretty. It's, his stomach is really bright orange. Get something with it. Yep. <laughs> Actually, one, another nice one. And that just tiny little piece. You can tell it's a different one. How it doesn't have that bright chest or stomach in it. Oh, didn't actually even get him in the mouth. Got him under the chin. <laughs> like the tiniest little bit of worm right there. Let's see if we'd catch something with that. Because if it does, I'm not going to uh, put a big piece of worm on there. My sinker kind of runs all the way down to the hook too. Okay, Let's try this again. Yeah, they follow it right to the surface. Nice to catch a really big one. Oh, hey, <laughs> good. Didn't have to mess with him. Dropped off himself. I still got two in the freezer from last time I came, so but I didn't. Well, I'm not gonna keep any because I don't really need any. A lot of these are pretty small. Gonna 
that splash of water in my eye. <laughs> The sun would stay out so I could see better. Yeah, yeah see, look at that. <laughs> That's why he wasn't able to get it very good. <laughs> He's very tiny. More like bait. <laughs> Try more worm in a little bit here. I got some. It's like a little bitty bit. Uh oh. Snag. Yeah. My, my eye starts watering. Starts burning for some reason. Get the wind in it. Well, I guess it's a sign to start moving forward. Snag. Yeah, snag done her. Doesn't look like there would be anything right here, but they were there.
corner or something. See me. Let's turn back. It's a little deeper than it was. Oh, there's a trout right in front of us. A couple of them right, right here. Oh, shoot! Right at this corner here. I can see him. There it is. Oh, little, oh, that was a better one. Yeah, that was a bigger one. It didn't didn't feel the hook too bad. And he'll bite it again. There he is. Nice. That's a better one. Except for that guy. That's a nice one. Now, if I was keeping fish right now, this would be one of them. Shoot. Kind of swallow it. Maybe I will be keeping one. I don't know if he's going to survive. You know, give him the hook and just have to tie a new hook on. It's a nice one. Fortunately, I have to give him the hook. Okay, I gotta. I lost track how many fish I've caught so far. Let's go back and check as I'm editing the video together. Okay. Back to fishing we go. See if there's anybody else in that little spot right there. Oh, unless if we uh, catch a branch. Yep, got another one there. Ho ho ho, almost. There could be more moving into the spot too, as I'm hearing the splashes and stuff, and they're coming to investigate.
to bend those two and I get a helpful hook. So, oh, there's a little bitty one there. That's not what we were looking for. Shoreline here. Oh. Looks like a cat print. <laughs> Small ones from right there. See, that might be a deep pocket here. I might be able to get something out of. Okay. Yeah, something. Something there. Bit of rapid right there, and then kind of goes into a deep pocket. Yeah, it's teeny tiny ones. Let's go in there again. Must be a pretty deep little pocket from that bit of rapids right there. It's a pretty nice size one. front of the head of the rapids there. Yep, something there. There we go. Swimming with the water. Yeah, I threw my worm. Yeah, it's a little better. Another nice one. And he didn't swallow it. That's always a plus. Another one about the same size swimming in the, the foot of the rip. end of the deep spot right there in front of us. Well, I appreciate you watching the video, especially if you're this far into it and you're still watching. Throw that back up to the rapids again because that's real. You know, we'll float right past him. See if he comes out after it. Nope, he didn't. There we go. Kind of along the weeds there. Oh yeah, he's he's looking at it. There we go. Oh, he's moving forward. Oh, sitting right next to him. Yep, he's looking at it. He's he's got. Oh, shoot. He got the worm, so. Oh, no, he didn't get it. Worm's still right there. It's coming downstream. I might actually uh, I'll just grab it and use it still. Oh, where'd it go? Oh, it's under the stick. If I can, get bent, if I can bend over. We got so much stuff on. There we go, got the worm back. Yeah, so I got my life jacket and my waders and the camera and the krill. Let's try it again. Let me look closer to the rapids now, see if it. Yep, yeah, who's sitting there? It... Yep, it got the bait again. really rain here but there was storms going through last night yeah, there we go it's got some weight going to it hopefully it uh, doesn't throw my bait which it just did nuts 
hate that when it does that. Another pretty one though. Nice size too. Yeah, and he's swallowed the hook. All these big guys are stealing my hooks too. Unless he dropped down in there. They're warning all his friends. <laughs> like, yeah, that hurt. It's got a hook in me. There we go. Oh, wow. That was another nice one. Get it back out there. Some good ones right in this area right here. Oh, yeah. Shoot. Yeah. Stole the bait. Did it tied it a little bit different on there. See if we can look into the guy that's been stealing my bait. Kind of moved up a little bit. I'm wondering if I'm now in their vision. Took half my bait. Well, actually more than half. my bait. fish here last time. This little deep dark pocket right here. Looks like a pretty well established trail going through here. Definitely not as good fishing this time around as the last. Got my bait. 
because he swims back out to the, his spot. He had my worm in his mouth. Well, Let's put one last worm on here. And that'll be another sign too. That corner and the last worm. Yeah, we'll put the last hole in on there. Maybe it'll get us a monster. Because if I get one that I'll eat with one fillet, then it might take. You know, it's like it's a 20 inch or something. Yeah, I think I'll keep it here. Okay, this time we have got basically the whole, whole worm except for the head that I put on previously. I'm going to try right this spot again. Just see if we can't get it to. Give something. A lot of them in there, but they're all a little six inches, not six inches, but little tiny things. <laughs> Might have been a beaver dam right here. <laughs> Let's try this corner. We got the overhanging trees. I like to sit up underneath those in the shade. Corner, and then you know that's a no. See, that one looks better. That might be a better car. Where you know it, you've walked over the whole stream. <laughs>
turned around back there. I don't know if I walked this far. So I caught a lot more fish. So I was, wasn't walking as much. I was fishing a lot more. Let's try. See if anybody's sitting in here. Protection on the other side. Whoa, yeah, whole bunch of big school of little ones. Oh, yeah. didn't even realize I had them on. Oh, yeah. it's a nice one, too. Hopefully. Oh wow, that was a big one. I hope it caught it on the camera. I doubt it did though, because I saw the reflection from like the, his side. That might have been one that I would have just had to keep. <laughs> oh man. Glad I came up this far. A little bit smaller one that was following after the fact. So hopefully, the big guy goes after it again. Yep. Oh yeah. That's a nice one. I think it might. Yeah. It's a, well, not as big as I thought it was, but still, nice fish. Yeah, that's a nice one. <laughs> I don't know if that's the one that I bit a second ago or not. That's a pretty fish though. It's gone. That's a pretty one. Well, if that was the one that I had hit the bait a little bit ago or not. Check that and figure if it stopped recording right when I'm getting the big ones to start to hit finally. Yes, yeah, so the little guys are grabbing it when I get past that certain spot. The big ones are up front. Up in there. Rapids right there too. That's yeah, that's how you do. Do I want to put more paint on? Cause that just that was that was a good nice one. Then. It wasn't the one I caught. It seemed like it was bigger, but it could just been the way it was in the water. Crawler's almost dead, so I'm gonna put the whole thing on. Oh, well, there you go. You can see all those guys, all baby, baby trout, future eaters. Okay, let's try it. Nice big worm on there. Oh, wow. 
That's uh I'm gonna have to go over there. <laughs> Shoot. I'll lose my bait anyways. <laughs> yeah, yeah, see look at that little bitty guy's trying to steal it. A lot of shallow stuff along that section. It might might have some pockets, but well, I guess I still got this worm in here. We will record as long as I do got battery as, as we walk back. Trying to get much. I just hate to waste that crawler. recording. I'll see you back at the blazer. Well, I'm on my way back and I had that worm left as I was going and I had that lot of worm left so I thought I'd throw it and sure enough threw it into this above this rapids here and got the last fish of the day. Here we go. And the worm is gone. Uh, not too far from the blazer, I don't think. So I will be back with you as soon as we're at the blazer. Okay, well, thank you so much for watching. It's still on my chest. Uh, I think so. Can't see very good, but thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Hope you have a great rest of your day, and I will talk to you in the comments.
with these waders on. It would be nice if it would have been a... If I didn't have all the stuff on it, it probably would have felt better, but... That section I could probably walk in with just water shoes on, but... There's not much in the way of big rocks or anything. And it was warm enough, I think, but... I like to wear the life jacket if I'm by myself. I like to... If I would fall in, I would like to make sure it stays, my head stays above water. <laughs> okay, we'll have a great rest of your day.